good morning, good morning. It is day 363 of from here to Jerusalem. Walking from West Cork to Jerusalem with a harp on your back. Sean the harp is here. Jerry the stick, of course, he's still with us. And my good self. And we're on our way to Swedengrad. Uh, now, Ina has organized that I can see some of the amazing sights out on that side, in Mezek and Svidingrad. Uh, I'm on the road that's parallel to the 8. The 8 is over there. So we're on this road, the 8 is over there. Uh, over there somewhere is Greece. Over there somewhere is Turkey. Not far from the border. Uh, so, Lubimet is where we were last night. And uh, I was very tired yesterday. As in, I was really, really tired. And I think I need to make myself the promise. Oh, water, water, water. Uh, that I won't be... Uh, Oh, more water, water, water. Can I get through here? Yes, I can. Bit mucky. Okay. That if I hear people who are going to talk to me about how terrible the state of the world is, I'm just going to tell them to. I have no, no time and no, no energy for it. Because I was wrecked. Like, I arrived in uh, Libimet. I went to find a place to stay and uh, I'm standing there and I'm thinking, please let me sit down, please let me sit down, let me sit down, I'm so tired. Uh, pain in my neck of course as well. It's not as bad now today, it's much better. Uh, it has been raining, just not on me, yesterday as well. It rained during the day. But uh, not on me, just a few spats, spits and spats when I walked into town. Now, uh, first the sad things, uh, of course, after, uh, where were we the day before? Oh man. So, Lübemitz is the place where uh, they have the biggest closed, uh, closed migrant center here in Bulgaria. Uh, we just passed it. It's, uh, yeah, it's not nice to see, of course. And I think uh, tomorrow, the day after, I, uh, you know, it, I cannot express to you how it feels to see those things. Because of course it's not normal and like you see all the barbed wire and there's people living right across from it and they have no choice like they can't they're not uh wealthy enough they don't have enough wealth to say i don't want to look at this i'm gonna go live somewhere else i i think one of the things i have really learned here is that our idea of what poverty is and what poverty actually looks like within Europe are two completely different things. And it's easy to judge the Bulgarians, but I tell you what, you would not want to be standing in their shoes because it's really complicated. It's really complicated, it's really hard, and they're very brave. They're very brave people. Uh, the ones that are here, they live with what is here every day. So now I'm gonna come across some sheep, I think, up there. Uh, I don't have a long day. Uh, tomorrow I will be sightseeing, I think, sightseeing and resting, because I am really tired for some reason. I think it's just emotional, uh, emotional and, uh, physical I'm just tired you know we're coming up to a year of walking and uh, 
if you don't have to be hard on yourself, don't be. Okay, here we go. Look at this. All those sheep, sheep feet. Now, and then, uh, the day after tomorrow, I'll be in Greece. And it'll be a whole new thing. Country number 10. What can I say? So coming up to the, uh, coming up to the border region now, uh, always tough. And uh, I spoke too soon when I said the dumping was done. Because uh, here we're back to uh, this. There you go. Okay. See you later. So I've got another swollen river on my hands. Uh, normally the track is there. Now it is like <sighs> little churning water thing. So, ah, darn. I'm uh, in a field now. The main road is over there. The eight is over there. <sighs> I'm gonna go try and uh, get up there. I don't really have a choice. <laughs> Ah, darn, darn, darn. That's a real shame. Whew. I have to climb. Darn, okay. Well, it is what it is. This is the thing with the water, eh? I should have known. I should have checked. Whew. Yeah. So what was I saying? I was saying lots of things. How do I get up there? It's lower there. Okay, I might have to walk back for a little bit. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. There we've got the river. Uh, well, river, river is a big, big word, but it's too deep for me to go through with the pack on my back. It was too fast flowing. Here's the bridge, the main road. It is what it is. I could go back to the stream over this little road. Let me check, let me check. It's too complicated getting back to the small track. So I'm just gonna do the last 10 kilometers on the eight again. There we are, dry up a little bit. This is it, the old bridge over the Maritza. Look at the Maritza being big here. Was it like a tiny little thing? Well, you know, tiny wasn't the word, but it wasn't like the biggest river ever. Here she's become like this big, wide, uh, flowing structure, river, and uh, this is the old bridge. The new bridge is over there. And I've nearly done my walking for the day. 
then I'm going to go meet the people of the tourist office and uh, I'll get a tour of Mizek and uh, Slivingrad. So, yeah, there's a lot to say. I can't think right now, so I'll do it later. Um, I walked the, the second part, more than the second part, so 10, 10 kilometers over the main road, over the eight, uh, <laughs> because of course I didn't check the bridges. Typical. Oh good, my feet are wet from uh, going through the field. The, the grain, there was a type of grain planted in there. It was very wet, it got into my shoes. Uh, I'll be able to change my socks now pretty soon. <sighs> Life is good. Okay, I have arrived. I put the harp uh, in the room. I've changed my socks. Uh, the shoes aren't too bad. It was really, the water ran into the socks. I'm going to have a cup of coffee now and let this uh, tourist information guy know that I'm here and that whenever he's ready, I'm ready to go and see some sights. It's a beautiful day. It is like really, really beautiful weather. Okay, let me see if I can find some coffee. See you in a little while. trees on the other side oh. there through the trees on the other side there's Turkey the village there is a Turkish village that is so strange like so we're in moon landscape at the moment <laughs> on a moon landscape road
Thank mm-hmm. you. 